Well, hello, Bear Watchers. Welcome to Monday Measures. And it's a spooky Monday Measures. <laughs> it's actually a regular recipe. We're going to show you how to make it spooky. But it's the stuffed bell peppers. And we're going to make it keto because that's easy to do. <laughs> and um, yeah, it's probably, it's going to be another easy one. And uh, we'll just get it going for you. We'll show you all the ingredients. <laughs> There's Mary. She's gonna, she's gonna video some. She's over there doing some pre-munching stuff, and so are the dogs. <laughs> They're always munching behind the video. They're like, "Oh, she's got food out. Munch, munch, munch." So <laughs> okay, here it comes. I'll show you what's in there. Oh my gosh, we are getting a late start today, but there's what everything, um, oh, I can't even talk. <laughs> there's everything that's going in this. We got the riced cauliflower and some diced tomatoes, onion, uh, taco seasoning. Taco seasoning is easy to make, guys. Make it yourself. And that way you know what's in there. You know there's no MSG and you know uh, it's you know what's in it and a hamburger um i had one of those big six pound packages i pulled a bunch out of there and um the olive oil and bell peppers Woo! People ask me why I chop onions on a paper plate. And I've answered that before, but it's been a long time. And there's a lot of new people here. And I just don't like the smell of the onions on my cutting board. I am really sensitive to the smell of onion, and I can smell it in the house for days after I've made onions, something with onions in it. So I just don't want that smell on my cutting boards. Yeah, because it feels like it does linger. Yeah. I did just buy a glass cutting board. Cutting, cutting glass? Yeah. <laughs> what would you call a glass cutting board? Uh, <laughs> it's I'm not a board. Glass. Uh, mm. <laughs> cutting slab. <laughs> Glass, I don't know, glass plate? I guess. I have no clue. This is the glass plate she's talking about. It's decorative, so I don't know. I should have asked her. Well, I gotta call her anyway. Heather broke the lid to her big cup that she got. So I'm gonna call her and see if it's okay to chop on. You know, I don't know how the transfer the um, picture. What, things are getting dragged out the door. <laughs> mm, it's getting all the cold air in. It says gently massage to separate. Um, things get uh, squished in between other things in my freezer. And so they get to a point to where I can't. So that's my gentle massaging. <laughs> you can break it up, Arthur. <laughs> there you go. Okay, we put some oil in the pan. 
we're gonna fry those onions. Saute them. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> uh, okay. We can get that. Unattended. <laughs> Cleaning the peppers. I'm doing this with my least dominant hand, so I'm not doing a great job. <laughs> oh well. these tops off. Oh, well that was not straight. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> we want to leave these as cups here. seeds out. We're going to put these tops back on. So we want to cut this off too. And I'm going to wash all those seeds out of there. But here's the fun part. If I can see what I'm doing. Yeah, yeah. I can see. You're doing great. <laughs> I'm doing great, huh? So far. There you go. Does so that work? easy. <laughs> yes. Okay, this way. Yeah. Oh, I might be bigger than the other one. <laughs> <laughs> Go. It looks a little sad. <laughs> <laughs> it looks a little sad. <laughs> well, because his eyes are like drooping. Should I make a nose? Uh, yeah, if you want to. A little tiny, tiny triangle, I guess. I still can't see what I'm doing. This is where young eyes would be helpful. Yeah, it's, it looks like it's doing good so far. Can I get it out of there? I think you've poked it too many times now. Oh, I see why, because that's the seam of the... There you go. That's good enough. Yeah. And then... Is it going to be too low? Um, it's probably fine. Hey, I like it. It's got some personality. <laughs> oh, fun. <laughs> Mom pointed out that now you have some little little snacks. Snacks. Yum, yum, yum. Those three things. Oh, you want to get. I'll just get that. So this is all a little bit more, because you know we make more than what the recipe calls for. Because there's a bunch of us here. Yeah. <laughs> Eat. Going through food quickly. Brown the hamburger up in there. We don't need to brown it all the way because it's going in the oven. One time I made these like taco, um, it's like a taco 
casserole thing? Because it was... You took some like crescent rolls and then you um, laid oh, them out. Yeah, that was really good. Yeah, and you you do taco seasoning and and beef and and you make like a cheesy taco-y mixture and then you put it in the crescent rolls and then you bake it. Um, but of course, I had to cook the meat first. Um, I think this was the time when mom mom was at work and life came over and he just gave me a bunch of stuff and said, "Here, cook this." <laughs> and uh, the meat was like a pure frozen block and I don't cook meat often so it was like I just kind of threw it in the pan and slowly started squishing away at it luckily it cooked fine but I was like oh, terrified I was like this is not going well but yeah it turned out great apparently I had to make a second one because everyone liked it so much so he bought me more frozen meat really <laughs> yeah <laughs> Yeah, this looks way easier than my experience. I guess I need this, the squishy uh, refrigerator meat. So I had to cut the bottom to make this flat. Yeah. Oop, I still got a seat in there. <laughs> and uh, I just put that bottom piece in there. Yeah. And press it down. That works. So it covers the hole. We're gonna put two tablespoons of taco seasoning in there. Really good. That smells good. Mm -hmm. Ooh, tomatoes. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to put the tomatoes in there. Now, it didn't say to drain the meat. You know, and a lot of keto stuff wants you to eat that fat. Oh yeah, that's true. Oh, those weren't diced very well, were they? they were <laughs> largely diced, huh? Yeah, I guess so. Does it say that? Uh, and that's got to cook some more. I guess it will cook that beef. Because we're going to cook that, a lot of that um, water from those tomatoes out of there. Mm. Mary's cut in the face. I got two. I have five peppers. <laughs> I, I think she's cut into her mouth part. <laughs> He's got a scar, okay guys? Don't judge him. Don't cut your finger. Maybe I can do like, yeah, my fingertips up here. Just do a straight across mouth, kind of? Kind of, yeah. <laughs> Scarface. Yeah. <laughs> I failed. Good chunks in there. So I drained the water out of that cauliflower rice. And put that in there. It's 
conversation going too fast for me today, guys. I keep having to make her say things twice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sometimes three times. I know. <laughs> Looking good. Mm-hmm. Okay. Put some cheese in there. Yeah. It's cheese time. <laughs> it's cheese time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. All waiting for their favorite treat. <laughs> <laughs> you turned the burner off. Oh, I forgot to turn the oven on. Oh. Uh. Three seventy-five, and that's. A we'll uh, let the pro cut the faces out because. Um, obviously I messed up on one of them back there <laughs> and he's got a permanent sky through his face so yeah I want to save these little green tops yeah so they look like pumpkins there they are <laughs> pretty fun <laughs> Really squished them in there. <laughs> yeah. Let me get them to fit in the pan. These are big peppers. Nice and cozy. Yeah. And this recipe actually called for you to cut the bell peppers in half and use the tops and bottoms. Oh. You know, cut the stems off and use the tops and bottoms so that way you've got like half peppers to fill. Oh, okay. Interesting. We want full peppers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was a weird. And it's not coming out the mouths or the eyes. I'm sure it will kind of when it cooks. Oh, hopefully they look okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's looking for droppings again. He like keeps his eyes on the floor. <laughs> He's like, where are they? I know they're coming. <laughs> There's nothing, Gibby. <laughs> what are you waiting for? <laughs> so funny. Looks like we got some extra. Yeah, yum. Maybe you could roll it in a burrito or something. Oh, there you go. I knew that I was going to have extra because... The recipe called for four peppers, uh, and I kind of doubled it. Yeah. Oh. I mean, I didn't double the tomatoes because I didn't want that too many tomatoes. <laughs> I'm going to switch it up. I got some Cheddar Jack here. I'll put that on top. Yeah. I put Mexican cheese or whatever you like. <laughs> Sorry guys, the cheese is falling on the stove. Oh, not on the ground. Not on the ground. <laughs> Sadness. He's like, oh, right when I walk away. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah.
in, in the oven for 25 minutes. Choo choo choo. Put it away. It's hot in there. Okay. Ready. Mmm. Mm. Nice and brown. It was kind of like melted marshmallows on the top. <laughs> you really can hear the bubbling. It doesn't look like I see that much out of the faces, maybe just the juices. Yeah. The trick is getting them out of there now. Yeah. I prepped the bowl. I was gonna put some little stuff in the bottom of the bowl. Oh, okay, it's easy. Let's see. Maybe you wanna like break the cheese apart on the up there a little. From the other ones. I'm squishing the face. Oh, it's, that's the one that I messed up already. Oh, was it? Yeah. Oh. This one's definitely a creeper. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna prep this plate. And do Plate. Wait, wait, wait. Kinda looks happy like he's been eating this stuff. Aww, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> but it's cute. It's cute from a distance. Don't don't look too close at it. <laughs> it was supposed to be gory. <laughs> wow. Scarface's face got a little squished when I tried to put the top back on. <laughs> <laughs> Usually, the day I do the Monday measures is hair washing day. So, <laughs> so my hair is all crazy. But that kind of matches the, the scary theme. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Uh, so we gotta try some. Let me get a fork. <laughs> Mary's over here watching the yellow one because um, because it's still boiling. It's got juice dripping out of the mouth. <laughs> that looks really hot. See if I burn my burn my tongue. Yum. We're eating, eating Scarface. <laughs> Badness. It's good. Oh. It's good. good right. With the cauliflower rice and everything. Oh, I forgot there was rice in there. So yeah. It's going to be an awfully meaty dish. <laughs> yeah. I like it. Well, I like cauliflower. Okay. It doesn't taste like cauliflower, though. Oh my gosh, look at it. <laughs> so he's standing up straight here. I didn't pet the dogs. <laughs> I don't know where the static's coming from. Mary didn't put up makeup on, so <laughs> she don't want to show her face. Okay. Thanks for watching. I hope you like this recipe and. It'll be out the day before Halloween. <laughs> so, you guys will have it in time for Halloween. And it's easy ingredients. So, I can't stop eating it. <laughs> I'm hungry. I only ate breakfast this morning. Well, I ate breakfast at lunch. Made by myself. I was going to film it, um, but then it didn't. So. Mary made panna kuchen. Yeah. <laughs> she made gluten free for me. She made a, a whole pan just for me. <laughs> okay. Bye for now. We'll see you in the next one. Like and subscribe and all that happy business. We're gaining people. So, 
we might get to that 5,000 by Christmas. Keeping our fingers crossed. 